Hi, this is Scott with Green Organics Pest Control and today we're going to show you how to screen your exhaust fans to keep scorpions out of your house. For this project you'll need some duct tape, scissors, and a fine mesh window screen. So when you pull off your exhaust fan it might look a little something like this. So first thing you're going to have to do is clean it off. So now we have a clean surface to put our screen on to tape it to. So once you have your clean plate you want to take your almost screen sized screen and trim it down to make sure that it fits completely within the screen so you can tape it down. Take your duct tape and measure it to the size you need. Tear it off and cut it in half. You'll need half a strip for each side. Do the sides without the tension tines first. You want to make sure you can go end to end all the way across the screen using the straight edge towards the outer part of the vent plate. Now the sides with the tines, we're going to cut around the tine making a not complete V-shaped cut. One on either side, push the tines towards the center and we'll secure those in a minute. And again end to end, make sure it's fully secured, keeping everything inside. Now to secure around the tension tine. We cut a few pieces of tape and we're going to tape right around it. One piece right down the center and one piece on either of the outsides and then one piece on each across the three pieces you just put down. So this is what your finished product should look like, more or less. Uh, if your exhaust fan is a different design, you may have to get a little creative in figuring out how to make yours completely secure. Uh, when you put it on the wall, the last step that you can do uh, in order to make it a little more secure than just doing this is to put some silicone or some sort of caulking along the edges where it's touching the ceiling. Um, and that'll completely keep everything out. Um, if you have any questions, feel free to give us a call at 602-448-1180. Be sure to visit us at greenorganicspest.com and check us out on Facebook and Twitter.